This video will explain how to export clips from the SkyCoach application on your iPad to the SkyCoach Cloud, as well as to the Files app for use with Huddle and other applications. We'll first start with exporting to the Files app. Please note that if you're trying to upload to Huddle, you must have iOS 13.1 or higher. Before we get started, you will want to make sure that you have a browser app such as Safari or Google on your dock, as well as the Files app. At the bottom of the event, you'll find the export icon. When you tap it, it will begin the export process. Select files for Huddle or others. When the export completes, you'll get a summary of what was exported. If there are fewer videos that exported than you were expecting, there are a couple of possibilities of where those videos exist. One, they could still be on the host and never made it down to this iPad. In that case, just plug in the Pressbox station, connect this iPad to it, and click Export again. The other possibility is those videos are still on the remote camera kits or the iOS devices that were recorded with. In those cases, you'll have to connect those devices to the network, make sure the plays to upload on those devices go down to zero, and then try to export again. When you're done exporting, just click OK and close the SkyCoach application. Now all of the files should reside in your iOS Files app. Open the Files app on your dock. If you don't see the SkyCoach folder immediately, just click Browse on my iPad, then open the SkyCoach folder. In the SkyCoach folder, you'll find an Export folder. Open it up, and you will find a folder for each angle that you recorded, as well as some CSV files that contain all the data. Open one of the folders. Now we see all of the plays for that angle. At this point, you'll want to swipe up from the bottom of the iPad to open the dock. You'll want to press down on your browser app until a pop-up menu comes up and drag that application to one side of the iPad. It's always best to do this in landscape so you can see more of the applications. Sometimes you may need to see more of one application than the other. You can slide the little divider left and right to give one application more space than the other. So in Huddle, you're going to want to log in, click the Upload button, and then in the Files app, you'll want to click Select, Select All, and then hold down on one of the plays until the pop-up menu comes across, and drag all of those videos over to the Huddle app. Those videos will begin uploading, in which case, if you have another angle that you'd like to upload, Huddle provides Add Another Angle button. Just click it, and in the Files app, navigate back to the other folder and do the same thing. You want to follow that process for every angle. Once you have the videos into Huddle, you'll want to follow their intercut process, which should be fairly simple because you should have the same number of clips for every angle. It's just a matter of clicking next. After we've merged all of our angles in the Huddle video player, we can import our data. When looking at the bottom of the player screen, you must look all the way to the right. If you're on an iPad, sometimes you may have to drag the screen over to get to the far right to see the three dots. Tap on the three dots, select Import Data, click the Choose button, click Browse, and navigate back to the SkyCoach export directory. You can choose any of the angle export files because all of them should have the exact same data. So select one of the files, click Import Breakdown Data. You'll be presented with the screen to match columns. Most of the columns are going to match because SkyCoach uses the same name. For the ones that don't match, you can either map them to a huddle column or you can choose Don't Import This Info, then click Import Data. So now we'll talk a little bit about uploading to the SkyCoach Cloud. First thing we need to do is make sure your iPad's connected to the SkyCoach Cloud. If down at the bottom it says Disconnected or anything like that, make sure you go to Menu, Settings, set the Network Mode to Cloud, and make sure you're on the internet. You definitely want to make sure when you're done with this to put it back in Client Mode for the next game. So now we'll tap the Export icon again. Choose SkyCoach Cloud. And what this is going to do is change the plays to upload from zero up to however many plays you have on this iPad. And then all you have to do is leave this event open till that plays to upload goes back down to zero. When it goes down to zero, everything that was on this iPad will have been pushed to the SkyCoach Cloud. 